Os. Konnichiwa, minasan. Not every karateka wants to strike a makiwara. Yet you still might want to condition your knuckles and your wrist. So this video is for you. Something I like to do is use a wall. Now we're not going to hit this wall, but what we're going to do is stand in kihondachi or heikodachi, have your feet shoulder width apart, and I like to, in this case, we're going to use my right uh, arm and fist, and I like to lean forward and focusing only on the top two knuckles. And now I'm just putting pressure on my top two knuckles through my wrist and arm and focusing all of that centered attention uh, of alignment. All right now I'm going to do that again on my left side standing in kihon or as we also say heikodachi your feet are straight and shoulder width apart putting my left fist out top two knuckles only and leaning forward, holding that position, stabilizing with a straight wrist, forearm, all of that is behind those top two knuckles. Now, again, we're not trying to cheat here. The top two knuckles only, not the flat of the fist. Now, this next exercise is probably going to be maybe a little uh, advanced for some but i have faith in you i think you could do it if you wanted to try now the secret to this is uh, in the footing you don't want to slip backwards but what i do is carefully i put my knuckles out i put my feet out and i dig in top two knuckles only and we're going to see if we can walk all the way down our wall and I actually have a bad back, yet I'm still somehow able to, to pull this off. But we're going to walk all the way down the wall on our knuckles only. Hold that position. Come down. Do a few push-ups. Knuckles in. Uh, elbows in. Top two knuckles down only. One. Two. Push back up to the wall. And walk those knuckles back up 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 and into push-up position again elbows tucked in one two again all of this was putting pressure on those top two knuckles and aligning the wrist without striking and uh, 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 doing all that stuff that you know you may not want to do uh, as a karateka. Remember in modern times, uh, makiwara tends to be known as any uh, striking surface. Traditionally, it's just a post in the ground that's uh, wrapped with uh, straw rope made of uh, rice, the rice plant, and it would be uh, struck by, by the karateka. Um, but in this case, we're using a wall and uh, this is too considered makiwara even though it's not uh, wrapped and rolled with um, any uh, material all right thank you so much if you want to learn more about the makiwara and how I like to use it and uh, knuckle conditioning also please check out my makiwara and knuckle conditioning course on udemy.com if you go to their search bar and type in john osta or ishinguru karate you'll find my course there dissect the dissection of ishinguru karate all right thank you for your time and we'll see y'all in the next video domo arigato gozaimashita